photography was a way in which I could express my own feelings. I might have turned to the gun or the knife, but by then I had chosen the camera. Gordon Parks' photography demanded that America look at itself. With all that black people were confronting, it requires a great deal of temerity to say that you're going to change that with your camera. I wanted to really pursue art, so what I've been doing is taking a page out of Gordon Parks' book. That's when I started realizing how important my imagery was to my city. Gordon Parks showed me it's important to create this visual narrative of an institutional racism and convey that to a viewer. I've come a long way. I use the camera to build people up and let people feel special. I think you guys are going to be famous. I owe a lot of where I'm at right now to Gordon. Gordon was that pathfinder. You're not going to get the great photograph if you don't establish trust. It absolutely sparks an interest in going places and telling stories. I wouldn't be a reporter today if it wasn't for Gordon Parks. The Learning Tree was the first major studio film directed by an African-American. He opened the door. And then to make a cultural phenomenon like Shaft is remarkable. What I have to do and I do it all again. Narrative work is how you change hearts and minds. If you don't work on the psychology, then you're not going to make any progress. For the first time, I understood what Gordon was talking about, that the camera is a real weapon. And I realized how powerful I am with a camera in my hand.